Hi folks, it's Max from uh, GalaxyNote2Root.com. That's my new site for uh, all the Galaxy Note 2. Um, I made a new site so I can stay organized. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to root your Galaxy Notes. Um, this is the GT N7100 model. Um, if you have that model, you can use this method. Now this method uh, will use the CWM recovery method. There's also an uh, auto root, root injected uh, stock firmware a method, but I don't recommend that method because I I tried it and I had a bunch of problems. So this way, um, it will increase your binary count, uh, but at least you'll be able to root it and it will not change your firmware. So this is the recommended method, and also the binary counter. Chainfire is already working on it. Uh, he's back from vacation, and uh, he's going to probably have a uh, triangle away app that uh, gets rid of it. So shouldn't be too long, and probably maybe by the time you see this video, he already has it up. So here's how to do it. Go ahead and turn your phone off. And uh, this is the easiest method. And hold down, volume down, center, and the... Oh, you got to do it real quick. As soon as you put it in, put hold down, volume down, center, and the power button. Alright, and it should be in that warning mode, um, warning screen. Hit volume up. And go ahead and put the screen back on so the battery doesn't fall out while you're flashing and then go ahead and connect it to your computer now I'll have another method for Linux and Mac uh, using Heimdall but this one will use Odin using your Windows computer so let's go to our computer next go ahead and download the Galaxy Note 2 root .zip. Uh, if you unzip it you get three files um, Odin and also cwm 6 root note 2tar um, go ahead and open up Odin and you'll see Odin here. Um, if You should get this yellow highlight sign uh, if you installed Samsung USB drivers. If you don't have it installed, go ahead and download it. I'll have links below on my blog post. You can download the uh, Samsung USB drivers, uh, run the .exe program, and uh, after you install it, go ahead and unplug your phone and put it back in, and you should see this yellow highlight si highlighted sign. And go ahead and hit PDA, and go find the folder where you unzip the files. Um, I have it under Galaxy Note 2 root and uh, find the cwm6-root-note2.tar click open and hit start. Alright, so that's PDA start. Do not touch anything else. Um, I will not be responsible if you touch anything else. And that will pretty much flash the recovery um, and also it's going to flash, it's going to root it for you and you can see it's actually rooting there and it's going to reboot and also this will allow you to uh, install custom ROMs and uh, let me switch the camera angle now there we go my phone's rebooting um, one note to consider if you want to get OTA updates you will have to reinstall stock recovery uh, that's pretty much it and also um, for those of you first timers I highly recommend you have some kind of insurance for your phone and uh, you can go ahead and go and see that you have Super SU. Go ahead and run it. Um, let me go ahead and download a rooted app, like a titanium backup app, to show you that I actually have root now. There we go. So it's installing a titanium backup app. I'll go ahead and open it, and it will ask you for root permission. Always hit grant um, if you want to grant permission, and that shows you that I have a rooted phone. So you can use this method on any GTN7100. This is the easiest method and my recommended method. There's an auto injection uh, root method, but usually you have to download a uh, big firmware. And uh, you know, I wouldn't I wouldn't use that method right now because I've had problems when using that. So um, go ahead and not use that. But anyway, that was how to um, root your phone. Now, if you have any problems uh, while using Odin, sometimes you can get in, into this thing called Odin firmware error mode. Um, that's fine, don't panic. You can run Odin back in that mode, try a different USB port. And also you can turn off Samsung keys if you have it running. Um, that can interfere with Odin. Other than that, you should be able to easily root your Galaxy Note 2. Um, it took me, what, five minutes? And uh, this method, you can use it on Gingerbread, or there is no Gingerbread, um, obviously it's Jelly Bean, but whatever OS comes out, it should still work in the future. Anyway, that was how to uh, root your Galaxy Note 2. Um, if you have a Galaxy Note 2, 
and you want to learn more about routing and uh, custom ROMs, don't forget to sign up for my new uh, site, my email list at uh, galaxynode2root.com. We update you once a week with ROM of the week uh, when there's a lot of ROMs out. And also it's a great way for you to get in contact with me and others if you need help with your phone and also it can help me. Um, and also if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me here, subscribe button up there and uh, thanks again if you have already and uh, I guess that's it and stay high on Android. And that was how to root your Galaxy Note 2 within less than 5 minutes. So easy to do. Um, anyway, see y'all later.